Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy, Your Future Boss. Follow me on Twitter at Your Future Boss. Y O U R F U T R B O S S. Don't forget, like this video, subscribe to the channel, and leave me a comment. You know what I mean? If you guys like what you see, I'd love to hear your feedback. Um, today, we got an unboxing for you guys. It's the Rue case for the iPhone 5. It's an ultra slim shell case, as you guys can see. Um, I like the packaging that it came in. It's pretty nice. There's my iPhone going off in the background, but we're going to move on from that. Um, the case is made out of a polycarbonate uh, plastic that's supposed to be really strong, and if it gets hit, you know what I mean, protect your phone. Now, when it comes to protecting your phone, you might want something a little bit stronger, like maybe like an otter box or something like that, but in my case... I love the iPhone 5 and its slim design, so I don't want to bulk up my phone by getting something that's so thick that it makes the design of the phone look bad. I mean, look at the beauty in this thing. This phone is thin, and I wanted to keep it thin. If you add a, any other big case on it, you're going to double the size at least of your phone. For the last couple of months, I've actually been using this case. For my phone, which is a Game Boy Pocket type um, case, it's made out of like a silicone type rubber, you know what I mean? It obviously doesn't scratch, but the problem with this case, as it's getting older, the rubber's kind of getting loose on it. So if I put it in my pocket and I try to take it out, it kind of comes undone a lot. So I wanted something that actually stays on my case I mean, on my phone, and, you know, that doesn't come off, so that's why I'm going to try this out, you know what I mean? And I did say I was going to uh, give you guys a review, so I guess this is a review for this case, too. Um, I got a lot of compliments. Everybody liked the Game Boy. It was pretty cool, but, and it did do a pretty good job because it does have the bumper, so if it, even if your phone's laying flat, it doesn't scratch on any surfaces. I'm pretty sure this one also has that same s sort of bumper, so... I'm ready to use it and see how it is. For let's 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 go ahead and open this thing up and unbox it. All right. Uh, maybe I should have checked. Oh, very easy. There's a little door, like an envelope down here. All right. It's kind of stuck in there. I'm right about to tear through this thing because. Yeah, we don't have time for that. So, let's go. Oh, yeah, you have to rip this off because it opens from the top. All right. There we go. The first look at the Rue case. You guys can see the logos on the back of the case. It's a very uh, shiny black design, which, as you can see, fingerprints are going to be all over this thing. Um, but, you know, we're a little wiped down. It shouldn't be that bad. Um, let's go ahead and put it into the iPhone. It's pretty much, you know, self-explanatory. You just pop it in here. Actually, I'm going to put in the sides with the knobs in first. And then just snap it in. Yep. Like a glove. Snapped in. I love it. Look, it's like the same size as my iPhone. It doesn't, yeah, it doesn't feel any heavier. Even though it does leave marks, just like the front of my case, with a little wipe, the marks will probably go away. I don't know if you guys can see that, but I'm really happy with this case. I'll let you guys know how I like it and if it holds my phone how it's supposed to. Well, that's it for now, guys. You know what I mean? Let me know. Don't forget, leave comments. Don't forget, subscribe. Like this video. It helps me out a lot. All right, guys. Till next time. It's your boy, your future boss. Peace.